Hello there. This video is going to introduce my implementation to John Conway's Ganola, the famous autocellular model. So here it is. The website right here is playgameoflife.live. And as you entered this website, you can see there was a board in from the field and an elegant landscape background picture. And in the middle of the board, there was a human-like patterns right here. And I added in at the entry of the website just to in memory of the John Conway who passed away recently because of COVID-19. And okay, let's go ahead. And at the bottom of this website, there are a menus of buttons. And here you can see that is reset to reset the board to its initial state and the start button. And some information about the the current current cell information and at the right side is pattern button and you can you could see there are some preset patterns here a uh, random mode and some famous game of flight pattern and also at at the bottom of this pattern pattern pop up you can you could see a link to a website here. This website is maintained by a guy who is very enthusiastic about gain of right. There are many gain of right patterns there. And and the, and the right is side there it is a rate button which you can change the speed of your evolution. So now let's get started. Yes, as you can see, it involves and the human <laughs> broken and fly away. Just in memory of John Conway. Right, let's reset it. And next thing we do is to pick up a pattern. And let me choose the Gospel Guild Gun. And try to start it. As you can see, after you click at start, the start button changes to pause. So now we let me pause it. Okay, it pauses. And let me continue. Mm, so, so now let me change the speed of the evolution at the right is part, click rate, a slower rate, and click here again, a faster rate, and the final median. There are three rate patterns. And also, and uh, as the uh, as the evolution goes uh, is going on we could see the changes of it the statistics information here evolution times keep increasing and the main lives keep changing so let's pause it again and decide it you can also delete it, delete it, reset it. And the fantastic part of my implementation to the draw, to this website is that you can simply use your mouse to create. Click at the board and click and create a cell. Create it again and to the and to the <laughs> remove it. So now let's 
generate a pattern. Okay, <laughs> mm, maybe a silly one. So let me see how it evolves. Start. Wow. A faster leg. Hmm. That's great. It appears to be infinite. Hmm. Okay. So that's it. Oh, oh. There are two more things I want to mention. At the right up, right upper corner of my website, you see here there is a language switcher where you can switch from English to Chinese, and the menu changes. And also you can switch back from Chinese to English. You see that? And at the left upper part of my website, it's my, it is my GitHub repository link. When you click at it, and it will jump, it will pop out a new tab. And there you can see my repository hosted at GitHub. And, and implementation to John Conway's Get of Light with JSX graph, yes, which is the uh, the animation library I use in this is this website. At the Gain of Life, the readme includes the following information: Gain of Light, uh, an English doc, and a Chinese doc. Algorithm description, demand description, and uh, yes. Uh, a project architecture, yeah, how I implement my website. It is divided into two main parts, logic part and the UI part. And the final one, my implementation, list, implementation result, uh, uh, my website link, and also some snapshots, some GIF pictures. Yeah, the GoPro. The Ghostbook GoPro come and some brand new idea. Yes, I suppose this should be an elegant gain of light implementation for those who are who know who want to know more about gain of light. This should be nice to have a play with it. Thanks.